Hello, it's me again. Welcome to my channel. And uh, maybe I should uh, introduce Vinyl Saturday because I have some new vinyl to show. And um, let's get on with it. The first uh, album I saw in the bin from uh, Cheaper Records was this one. Jutro Tall. And um, what caught my attention was, of course, the stereo mix done by Stephen Wilson. He does a lot of mixes. I have uh, Aqualung special uh, version and uh, well this was uh, relatively, relatively cheap so I thought uh, let's pick it up. Uh, Jitro Tall, of course Ian Anderson uh, I know, uh, the rest of the music I don't know that uh, very much. Um, symphonic rock, progressive rock, 60s, 70s rock. Um, my, introdu my introduction was uh, uh, Genesis, that was my first introduction and I left it a little bit with Genesis, yes, and uh, the other bands are like Jutro Tull and uh, Soft Machine and um, Gentle Giant, uh, I come to um, explore now a little bit. So, let's see, Inner Sleeve, in the, in the Ian Anderson I think on uh, the flute. Oh, this is Ian Anderson, two flutes. Live recording, I don't know if this is a live recording. Recorded the Morgan Studio, so no, it's not a live recording, I guess. It's on the Chrysalis, side one, and side two. So I'm expecting a good produced, mastered album and something to explore. The next, in uh, if you saw my other videos, you. Uh, Notice that I bought some Pink Floyd albums. This is another one from the same uh, batch, I think. It's uh, remastered by uh, James Guthrie, Joe Plant and Bernie Grundman. And I'm a little bit in the Bernie Grundman uh, vibe today, nowadays, because I noticed that the mastering and the sounds is, is very good. So I have this on CD. I have the box, I've shown you the box set from uh, Pink Floyd. But I like the albums also very much. Uh, of course the cover art, uh, but also the, the way it sounds. Let's be careful because I'm a little bit hasty nowadays. The stickers don't. And for someone from Holland, this is of course a great cover. A cow. The backside. So for the cover alone, it's very nice. Gatefold. Uh, these are made in 2016. Adam Hartmoller, very long, nice track. If Summer of 68, Fell Sun and Ellen's Psychedelic. Very nice. Same labels as the others, I think. Pink Floyd Records. So if you want to explore a little bit with some better quality of vinyl, of pressings, of music sound. Watch the name Bernie Grundman. Normally it's uh, good, very good. And that's why also I bought this uh, Frank Zappa. I was with a friend, an older friend, who had some vinyl and he had uh, Zappa, old Zappa, uh, Shake Your Booty and Joey's Garage. I listened to it and I uh, thought, wow, it sounds great. So uh, I looked it up and uh, in Frank Zappa has a lot of releases and this is uh, also a re-release. This is the 15th anniversary Translucent Hot Pink and it's pressed at Palace. And um, through the channel from Michael from Germany, 45 audiophile, uh, he says Palace, yeah, it's a great, great record plant and um, he likes the way the, the, the albums are pressed. And all these releases, reissues by the Zappa records uh, are uh, mastered, remastered by Bernie Gritman. So, again. And that's why I thought for this price, well, and the sounds, the way the sound, the old records sound from Zappa, I thought, uh, let's try. I bought two Frank Zappa records. Hot Reds, I know a little bit from, uh, if I'm correct, from 69. So record front cover back cover 
Peace and Regalia, of course known as Winnie the Wimp, some of Mr. Jeans, Little Umbrellas, the Gumbo Variations and it must be a Camel. I went to a concert, not from Zappa, but from, from his son, Dweezil Zappa. So, depends on the time of the year and the time I'm feeling, I'm listening to um, to Frank Zappa. It's, I think he's a great musician, great great man, great personality. I see a musician, Captain Beefheart, of course, yeah. It's, it's, uh, I think it's unbelievable what this man does did for the music. So we have your very pinkish vinyl, translucent, so maybe it's uh, glowing in the light, I don't know. But for me it's the music and the mastering. So Hot Reds by Frank Zappa. Another album I saw, and these are nicely priced, normally priced records. It's Zoot Lures. Um, this, I don't know, this album is from 76. Terry Bojo, of course, I know him very much. Uh, Murphy, how was he called? Napoleon Murphy Brock, very nice voice. I uh, so, uh, didn't see him live, but very nice man. Saxophone player, unbelievable voice, very nice. Let's see if I can open this up, Sander, without breaking the record. Very tight. Zuda Lures. With for me some more known albums, the more numbers tracks than the other album. Doesn't go the way I want it. So I have to do it the way it goes. Not, not an uh, gate fault. To the loose, wind up working in the gas station. Black napkins, of course, known for the torsion of the stops. Very high nice track, Mr. Pink. And uh, Zoot the Lores, Disco Boy. Tracks I know. So, very curious if I can how the music sounds. Last, the special one um, is this album by Roger Waters. And um, it's uh, it's sealed like this, so you hear the you can take it off. And it's from America, I think. Uh, Roger Waters, Amused to Death. Uh, of course, Roger Waters from Pink Floyd, well known. I think this album is very well known. And this is from uh, Analog Productions. So I did some videos about audiophile records, and I think this is maybe one of the maybe one of the best. Uh, labels to re-release material. Um, it says all kind of things and uh, quality records and blah blah blah. Um, but yeah, I ordered it uh, and it was not that expensive, I thought. The guy who's left, the, the woman who sold it said, oh, it's not cheap, I said it's relatively, relatively, relatively what is cheap, what is expensive. So very nice English for me. How you, you see the cover already is very, 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 very good. Very nice little child watching television, amused to death. Maybe like Porcupine Tree, if you have a blank planet. Maybe that kind of stuff. Um, what they, what he tries to say. Gatefold. So very thick uh, cotton. You hear the crackling with all the lyrics. The back side. Uh, mixed by James Guthrie. Uh, Guthrie I saw also with Pink Floyd. Let's open it up. There's also a version, a uh, 45 version. Um, the 45 uh, version is uh, four albums, so that's also possible. You see on the inside the carton is used. I uh, heard, heard from the Stoughton out, out uh, um, um, how do you call it, out yeah, the covers, uh, Stoughton covers. Maybe is this also from that uh, fabric. 
So let's see for the vinyl. So very nice in uh, rice paper inner bags. So everything breathes quality. C, D. I expect very flat. 180 grams final, maybe 200. I don't know. I think 180. And this is a booklet from Analog Productions. So here are the. So I also ordered uh, the Dave Brubeck 45. Um, the one steps. Or once I don't know if it's the one step. No, it's not the one step. One step is from uh, another. But yes, I see here the doors. So a lot of different uh, kind of music genres, uh, jazz, rock. Um, they put out a very nice label. And here you see Jack Chet with his uh, his albums. That's the man who owns the record plant. Here's some more jazz. So um, some very nice vinyl. Um, to be very careful and to listen carefully if I hear the quality of the music. I'm very happy with the purchase I've done today. Excuse me for my uh, stuttering during the videos, but what the hell. I hope you like it anyway, and until the next time, bye bye.